Oma's in the carrier right now because he didn't go poo poo. I'm gonna try to get him to go poo poo one last time before I leave. But I'm leaving when it's still dark, so. I mean, he had a big thong of broccoli, you would think he would go poo poo, but. When I take him out again, he might, because sometimes he's just stubborn and he wants to go in the house. And the thing is, when he has to go in the house, if he's home, he's going in the bathroom, obviously, but when I take him out, he needs to go, you know? That's number one. Number two, uh, even in regards to dog woman, Auntie did wrong, okay? Remember, I'm not destitute. I have money in the bank, a few thousand, um, like three, and plus I get a thousand a month, okay? I could pay all my mother's bills out of pocket. Auntie had no right to say to dog woman, hold off on taking Angel to the vet. Laura froze the bank account, implying, you know, there's no money to pay for Angel's vet, et cetera, et cetera. Lead in, again, she did it on purpose, just like she bounced this month's rent check, okay? And according to my mom, it shouldn't have mattered that November's rent check bounced from my mom's account because my mom had told me that Auntie had sent in a check. And my auntie was paying the bills, remember? Fucking with my mom's head. I'm sick of my Aunt Miriam's fucking shit, okay?